Hello everyone, and welcome to this episode of Surviving Minecraft. This is Civic Dude, and I think we're up to episode 12 now. And for this episode, guys, this is going to be the last episode before Minecraft 1.5. So, um, you know, we got a lot of things we're waiting on for 1.5, you know, with uh, the new Redstone update. Uh, a lot of things going to be changing. Uh, a lot of new possibilities for machines that we can make and uh, automated farms and sorting and all kinds of awesome things like that. So we're going to kind of do some cleanup and uh, housework uh, during this episode. Uh, and we're going to build another house, another farm. Um, going to have a chicken farm this time. I really have no use for chickens other than you know to eat them. <laughs> um, but I do want to at least make a chicken farm because uh, I want to so we're going to do it um, one thing I want to do is on our little what is this, a blacksmith? I wanted to add just for some finishing touches these uh, stone buttons they kind of look like nails so uh, they look pretty cool. So we're going to do this on just this top section, really. And it takes a lot of these guys to do this. Um, so anyways, um, what's been going on? Well, it's been probably three days, three or four days since I've made a video. Um, oh, very nice. That looks good. Yeah, okay, let's go... I'm going to make some more now. I don't know why I needed the... <laughs> I did not need the <laughs> the workbench to make these. I just felt like I needed to. So let's go do this on the back side now. Um, it's been a few days since I made a video. But that does not mean I have not been active. Um, been following the, the guys on the Hypermine server. And uh, they actually have a new map that they just started. And they actually put up a... Uh, they put up a an announcement video saying that they're doing that so that they will uh, and they're offering uh, new spots to a couple new people so uh, you know I definitely threw my name into the hat um, hoping that uh, hoping that you'll see me on there um, that oh dang I need some over there too um, I would really enjoy doing that uh, yeah, I could bring you guys more videos more community involvement um, it would be freaking awesome. So, we'll see how that goes. Um, good luck to everyone that did com uh, in, uh, what am I saying? Good luck to everyone that did enter the contest, or the, the I don't know what you call it, enter to get their spot on the server. Um, I'm sure it'll be fun, uh, no matter what the outcome. Okay, that should be enough of these. And, uh, so, just kind of winding down for the evening. Um, and we just got done watching uh, The Biggest Loser. And uh, I don't know if you guys feel the way that I do, but I really love that watching that show. But I always find myself watching that show and for some reason, like, snacking on something. So I'm, like, pigging out on pizza or, you know, ice cream or whatever. And I always feel like the laziest person in the world whenever I watch that show because they're always working out so dedicated, and I definitely am not. <laughs> so, yeah, that's just my my views on the show. I really love watching the show. It's it's incredible the things that they do on that show. So let's add a couple more of these nails, and that should probably do it. There we go. And it's nighttime already. Let's go for a quick sleep, and I'll see you guys in the morning. Okay, guys. So, I'm thinking that, you know, I want the chicken farm kind of over here. And the main reason for that is I hate the sound of the chickens in this game, and I want them. Oh, where is this zombie? 
and I want them as far away from uh, where I normally you know work and stuff as possible <laughs> to be honest <laughs> so I'm thinking I'll bring the road kind of down here a little bit like this and then put the, the chicken farm right here so what that means is that I need to mark out a spot clear some land and some trees in order to get started building this thing it's uh, kinda gonna be a similar but smaller version of this house that we made earlier in the previous episode um, but not quite the same it'll be a little bit different it'll still have kinda this you know this uh, fence look here and the nails and uh, stuff like that but uh, you know, it'll still it'll still be still be unique. I'm kind of going to incorporate a little bit of a, a yard, like this one has too. So it'll have kind of a mixture of the two houses that I've made so far. So I'll get started building, and I'll see you guys in just a minute. All right, guys. So I've got the frame uh, laid out for the f chicken coop now. I've got the main house going to be right here, and the actual chicken coop is going to be right here. So this part with the the tree logs is going to be the like the covered part, the coop part, and then over here is going to be kind of a free range fenced in area. So let me get started on uh, the framework here, and I'll kind of bring you back in as I get more progress done. Okay, guys, quick update. I've um, got the first floor. Um, laid out and uh, along with the second little extension thing um, some of the roof done cobblestone walls and some of the chicken coop assembled um, so far it's going pretty great um, you know the uh, I usually take a you know a little time in designing these I just want to make sure that they look that I'm pleased with how they how they look um, I'm not really a designer or an architect um, by nature, and so you know, this stuff doesn't really come all all that natural to me. So uh, I find that just kind of laying it out beforehand helps helps to me to figure out uh, what I want to do. And uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna kind of work, continue working here, and kind of bring you guys along for a little bit of this, so you can kind of see the the building process and how this kind of works. Um, so, you know, kind of laid out the, I'm going to lay out the roof now on the, whatchamacallit, bird cage chicken coop thing. Is that how I do it? Probably not. So, we're just kind of going along for the ride here. Um, do, 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 boom. Yes. So there is a new, I don't know if you guys saw it, but there's a new YouTube channel layout yet again. Um, they do this ever so often. And uh, uh, that's not how I do it. And that's a shovel. And so basically, um, <laughs> long story short, I'm going to need to redesign my channel a little bit. Um, this means you know new art, different art, different layout, uh, that kind of thing. And uh, with that, you know, if you guys wanted to send in some some custom art for me to for me to use and spotlight on my channel, I'd be more than happy to help you guys out, give you some shout outs, um, you know, some recognition and some community awareness, I guess. This is definitely a thing that I want to uh, share with everybody. I don't want to just you know, make these videos and not really interact with you guys at all. So I'm gonna ooh, doo, 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 doo. I'm gonna open it up. If you guys want to send in some art, I'd be more than happy to spotlight it. So let's see, what's the next thing I do? Oh crap. Next thing I do, I think is that yeah, there we go. That's not it. So there we go. Like I said, after this episode is going to be the uh, the 1.5 update, 
And so we're going to, after this episode, really kick it into gear where we can start automating our farms um, using the sorting systems, using the hoppers, the Minecraft or the uh, redstone blocks, um, all, co all kinds of things like that. Nether quartz, um, you know, the new ores from the nether stuff. Oh, dang it, that's not what I wanted. Stuff like that. Okay, let's go back over here. Piggy, Piggy, how did you get up there? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's crazy. Okay, I think that's it. I might have to double check this part right here. I can't remember if that's exactly how I wanted to do it or not. But, yeah, so now, oh, there's that pig again. We have enough pigs. Ah, oh, come back. So we do not need you. Oof. But, I'll be merciful. I won't kill you. Just stay off of my land. Okay. Enough of that. And now for something completely different. And today, lads, we're tracking the elusive zombie villager. Our foe is cunning. He tracks us very slowly. But we are smarter than the zombie. We must lead him back to our trap where we will secure him. And then, when we have the proper equipment, we will free him of his curse. So, anyways, enough of that. I have reworked the, uh, oh my guy, I've reworked the zombie catcher so that uh, it should work this time if he will keep following me. Come on. You need an item? There you go. Okay, so we give him an item. That way he should not despawn. We're going to lead him up to our catcher device. And keep him contained. And hopefully there's no creepers around here. I'd be really upset if there was. Okay, come on, guy. Watch this, guys. This is going to work. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Except there's somehow a creeper in there. Are you kidding me? <laughs> there we go. Okay. One zombie villager secured. Well done, lads. Well done, lads. And now, for your regularly scheduled programming. And we're back, guys. So I've got the, I think I've got the exterior all mocked up, you know, pretty much done. Still need to put like the glass in and uh, the nails on the, on the logs here for the accent features. And also the, uh, you know, the piece here for the actual chickens. Um, but the, the structure itself I think is, is good to go. So now what we got to do is put the, uh, the floors in, the interior, the walls, um, and decorate this little dude. So, not much more to go now. Alright guys, so hopefully you enjoyed that little bit. A little break from our, our building here. It's the next morning and I'm just kind of cleaning up the, uh, the leftovers, as it were, of these, uh, of these mobs. I'm trying to get them gone. don't want them around. <gasps> An egg. Let's see if we can get another chicken. Oh, I've got two eggs. Sweet. Nothing. Dang it. Fair enough. Okay, well, let me see if I can get a good vantage point. I'm, I'm really nervous. I just don't want any creepers to uh, surprise me here. It's the worst thing in the world whenever you're trying to film. Okay. So let's go over here. And voila! There is our kit, uh, what do you call it? Chicken coop. 
with house. <laughs> so let's go for a little tour. Over here we have the outside little pin for the uh, the chickens. So far we just have one. And then whenever it gets nighttime and uh, rainy or whatever, they can go in here, covered area, a little chicken coop, side door, and a front door, like so. You notice I added some buttons for nails. I think they just are a really nice accent feature on these houses. Okay, moving in to the house, we have a uh, fairly similar setup to the butcher shop, or not the butcher shop, the blacksmith, uh, with the staircase on the left side here and a little nook over here. I'm probably going to put like a chest or something right there, maybe a couch or a table or something over here, like a breakfast nook area, maybe. We'll see. And then going upstairs, uh, you'll notice we have the the bedroom, which is <laughs> not very big. But it's not intended to be. This is a very much smaller scale house than the blacksmith house. It's only got two floors and then this little hideaway spot that you can put like a chest or something over here. And, you know, that's pretty much it. This is uh, this was a pretty quick house to make. Um, I still have some furnishing and stuff to do, like chests and, you know, chairs or whatever, but... For the most part, this is a fully functioning house now. And, uh, yeah, I'm ready to call this one complete. Or 90% complete. <laughs> so, let's see. With that, guys, I think this is going to do it for this episode. Um, I really want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, this has been a good episode. Lots of fun. And... We're getting a pretty good establishment going on this island. We've got our our main house that we actually stay in. We've got our butcher shop with the cows and the pigs. Blacksmith with the ores and the smelting and the anvil. And then we have this newest chicken coop for our chicken hatching and eating needs. And uh, the next episode, guys, I'm really getting excited. Uh, the next episode is going to be the first one in the new 1.5 update. So we're going to you know, look forward to us actually doing some more redstone stuff with uh, sorters, or sorters, hoppers, repeaters, um, dispensers, droppers, all the good new redstone blocks and uh, features that we can do with the redstone update. So um, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. We're going to have to think of a name for you. Because you're going to be here for a while. You're going to be the the Adam to our planet Earth. So we're going to have to find you an Eve. But you are going to be responsible for populating this entire island. So, why don't we think of something to call you? Maybe Bernard. Yeah, I like Bernard. Take care. <laughs>